everyone? How you all doing? I actually put on my mic a little earlier this time before uh, setting the stream, uh, sharing the stream out as much as I can before we truly begin. I love this song, this theme song so much. How's everyone doing? And last but not least... On the Twitter. Sorry for the slow start. I'm just trying to get myself ready for this. Just need to retweet this on the JCG Twitter. So, sorry about that, just had to get started a little bit, and also was uh, grabbing some food before I officially made the stream go live. I'm hungry. Mm. Good stuff. Alright, let's get the show on the road, ladies and gentlemen. Greetings, curious concerns of visitors or fellow followers. This is Brian from Joy Charge Gamers, charging you with joy, and welcome back to Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. It has been a while since I last played this. I mean, actually, yeah, it actually has been a while. It's been like at least, I think, a week or so, because I think the last time I streamed was on last Tuesday. And uh, Thursday, I wasn't able to, wait, was it Thursday that I last streamed? I don't know, because I, um, I was at my dad's for a while and I didn't come back until Thursday. Actually, I think it has been two weeks. I'm not exactly sure, whatever, anyway. I'm back, ladies and gentlemen. Planning on doing a stream yesterday for Black Ops 4 Zombies. Maybe coming some of the new stuff for the second half of Operation Op Apocalypse Z. But uh, that didn't happen because of some uh, unexpected circumstances. 
But now I, I decided, you know what, for today I'm just going to continue streaming Bloodstained. Because I'm not really in the mood to play Black Ops 4 right now. I was already playing a little bit this morning and a little bit worn out from the game as of recently. I've been trying to play other games as of recently, including the new Wolfenstein. I've actually been having a lot of fun with that game since it came out. And uh, I wish I could cover it, but I don't own the PS4 version. I only have the Switch version. And not that it really means much because, I don't know. It's a good game, that's all I, I really say, but that's not the focus of today's stream. We're continuing back on the Bloodstained, and we're going to have a goddamn golly old time doing so, so let's have some fun. We shall continue our journey of Lara Buckets. <laughs> uh, and also, I haven't done much on my personal save file because it's been a while since I last played this game uh, personally. Uh Oh shoot, I just realized the fucking stream is going on in my room because I have the Twitch page open. Give me a moment while the game loads. Please excuse the silence. To think the stream would start playing audio, it would all be in all places. It would, my room would be the last place I would expect it to be in. Anyway, oh. I also made myself some chicken fries. The Tyson brand, very nice. But back to the journey at hand. So last time, we went off against a very fucking easy boss. Unexpectedly easy because I remember fighting the same enemy in the uh, the eight bit game, Bloodstained, uh, Rich Curse of the Moon, another good good game as well. Now, I'm trying to remember, didn't I unlock a new shard that let me do a a thing, or was that just a double jump? Yeah, I think it was just a double jump. I could have sworn I unlocked a new ability. God, this music was doing so good. Also, I've also got myself a can of monster import. Ah, because hey, I need to treat myself too sometimes. All right, so we got ourselves a double jump. And I can't seem to go this way just yet. I'm willing to bet that we'll find some way to do that at some point. Yeah, you can fuck off. I got some peaches. Or something. Flowers. Very pretty flowers. Alright. Now, where on earth am I supposed to go next? I know there's an underpath down here. Uh oh. Oh, shit! Oh, no! Fuck it! I hate you! Get the fuck out of here! The shit. Oh. The poltergeist. Those things were pretty annoying in Curse of the Moon. I didn't even realize there was a doorway here. So I hate the fucking fact that the. The fucking intersections between areas is slow. Did that change or something? I don't know. Aha! Aha! I found a secret stairway! Ain't that just a pickle peach? No, thank you. I was going to do a little bit more exploring. Because it's actually been a while since I last played and I need to kind of get my bearings a little bit. Fuck. Piece of shit! Oh, that's right. This one you gotta do the thing on. Magic! Wait. So anyway, how's everyone else doing? 
It has been a while since I last streamed, so I don't know how things are going. But yeah, there's a lot, a lot of stuff's just been going on as of recently. Let's go see our, the painting, I guess. I don't know. Of, of this scrumptious food. Oh, hello. I got a new shard! Stab her through the hat! <laughs> oh, increases firearm damage. Nice. Wait, I don't know if you guys know this, but um, I'm actually having uh, a, two things, not just the chicken fries, but I'm also having some watermelon as well. But here's the catch, though. It's not just any old watermelon. You guys know how watermelon's normally, like, red or pink and stuff like that, right? Well, well, this watermelon, on the other hand, is very different. It's actually yellow. Like, it's a complete... I'm not sure what, kind, what the name of the watermelon is, but it's actually yellow and not red like it normally is. It was so, like, fucking... Like, mind-shattering at first, because when I first saw it, I was like, what kind of fucking fruit is this thing? And I got a sample, and I taste it, and it's like, this, 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 is, this is fucking watermelon. This is fucking watermelon. This is fucking watermelon. My life is a lie. That's a normal melon. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is a normal melon, but watermelon, I have never had a watermelon that was yellow before. And it tasted exactly the same. Like, it tasted like any other normal watermelon does, and it's just yellow. It's like, my life is a lie, and my world has been shattered, and I don't know what to say about that. Hello, Alucard. <laughs> Discount Alucard. Yeah, I already took out a book. Be certain to return what you borrow. This is a library, not a bookshop. <laughs> Bye, Alucard. <laughs> God, I love Robert Algada voices. voices. He was awesome in Symphony of the Night, and the fact that they brought him here as a, as a Dracula-type character, or Alucard, is amazing. Are you all right? Oh, thank you. You're so kind. Oh, wait, that's right. I probably should have healed up in that area. Whoopsie daisies. Nope. Bye. <laughs> okay. That's all I needed to do. Anyway, we shall progress with our journey. Ah. I thought I saw something outside. It's just my mind playing tricks on me. Damn these 115 based illusions. Oh shoot, okay. I don't know where the heck to go right now. Books. Hello, Cart Lol. So, I'm not certain if there's an area I haven't been to before that seems re-exploration in. But now that I have this double jump ability, it should help me in some regard. Alright, leveled up. Uh, mm, excuse me. Maybe I should try and retrace my steps. Go back a little bit. Yeah, let's just go back for a little bit. I mean, I have fast travel. But if I ever need to go back here, I will.
Yeah, there's a hole up there. Maybe now is a good time to start going up that way. Aha! I can now go up here. Back to the clock tower. The Dola Hammerhead. Fucking... So what, is the Dulla Hammer the equivalent of Medusa? Or am I gonna see a monster that has a completely different style? What the hell? Okay, I guess I can't go that way. Ah! Need to be a oh, what the fuck? What just happened there? Duh, shit! I guess we're going this way. Alrighty, anything here on this side? Okay. You seem s your stream crashed. The fuck? Um, I'm checking right now. I'm just moving left and right because I'm trying to see if everything's working fine on my end. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with your end because the stream's perfectly fine on mine. Try refreshing it. If it crashed for you, it was pro- if it, like I said, it crashed, it's probably on your end because I just checked for me. I'm fine. I, I can see the stream perfectly fine. Also, I got poison, so I probably need to go check my thing. Do I have an antidote? Oh, okay. Just gotta use this thing. Okay. Have I been here before? No, I couldn't have possibly been here. There's apparently a chest up there that I can't reach by normal means. Maybe I will get an ability that lets me how that teaches me how to fly. It's always, always, always the fucking arrows that save my ass. An emerald and a ruby? Oh boy, I didn't realize we were playing Pokemon. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. My jokes are probably the worst that you can imagine. So you may as well just ignore me here. We got another wolf, man. Oh wait, I just realized there was a purple uh, candle right over here. Alright, sorry, just get out. Yeah, have another chicken fry. Uh, Cot, are you there? Is the stream working fine? Oh, what do you know? I get poison, then I get resistance to poison. I'm fucking magical. Oh shit, I'm about to die. Is 
the fuck? A scythe might. People seem to have left. Am I still live? I'm still live. It's perfectly fine for me. Sweets are. Apparently, oh fuck, <laughs> well shit, I fell. It's back, it's been, it seems fine on my end. I, I checked when they said it crashed, and it seemed fine on my end. A beast guardian. I don't want a beast guardian. I'm fine with my good boy Shovel Knight. He is the best guardian. He will always help me. Just need a little bit of a sip of a uh, monster. Ah, good shit. I just hope to God it doesn't like fucking make me go crash when I get to work. Yeah, I need to start selling some of these things at some point. There we go. No, 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 fuck. No! Fuck. All right, let's try that again, shall we? Kind of late in your attacks there. You're kind of late in your attacks there, girl. Boy. Alright, this camera is pretty fucking close. Like, really close. And so closed in on our character. Doesn't it look like that? Ooh, I found a secret that gave me some magic points, mana points, whatever. Oh god, it's Vinny from Everman Hybrid! He came back in Bloodstain! What the fuck is that? A fucking chainsaw shield? Shield? Oh. What the fuck? Who's that? That guy looks familiar. I swear, all the paintings have different people on them, and I don't know who they are. All right, I need to take another sip. Ah, have some more of this yellow watermelon. Completely normal. Oh, hello. Wait. I don't want to take that just yet. Another emerald, ruby, and silver. Oh god, it's Jeff! <laughs> I'm joking, of course. It's obviously not, not really the guys from Everman Hybrid. Although, who knows? Maybe they contributed to this project. I have no idea. It's funny, because I was literally just watching uh, Everman Hybrid explain part seven yesterday. 
and got it. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is just me, but I think Nick really didn't do much effort in terms of editing in that video. Like, I'm pretty sure it was mostly like letting the videos be speak for themselves. But there was like more showing what happened and less explaining until like the end of the video. All right, another breakable wall. And I got an invisible blade. Got a chest. Eye potion. Hey, nice. Oh, a fucking green crystal. Dulla hammer head. Summon forth Dulla head to help you. Oh shit. Oh, I can call my own fucking Medusa head. As a familiar, like the fairy here. fine with my fairy for now. All right, wait. Save room. Save room. Hey. All right, break time. Time for more chicken fries. Now, what could be this way? Uh, wait. Wait. Oh, it's an elevator spot. Ah, okay, so it takes me to different floors. All right. Well, good thing I went out of my way to explore because I wanted to find some stuff, and I did. Dead. Not a big surprise. Or anything. Jeez, this place is riding habit. Are you? Are, okay, all right. That that cannot be fucking coincidence. Riding habit. How many fucking? Is this like Everman Hybrid Central in this fucking area of the castle? What is going on here? Was Koji Igarashi a fan of the fucking EMH series? Did he actually have like pictures of habit somewhere around here? If I find one picture of Habit, I'm gonna be sad, but I'm also gonna be fucking stoked because Habit was my favorite character from EMH. Just gotta find and see if there's any more secrets. Alright, let's actually save because it looks like we're about to go to a boss room. Alrighty. Oh shit! <laughs> Directed shield. Call forth a shield that can be faced in any direction. Oh fuck yes! Is that like the fucking spiky shield? I wanna see this. Alright, directed shield. 30 per second. All right, well, that's fucking Shovel Knight, duh. Just trying to remember. What was the fucking button? Oh, that's right, yeah, duh. Ah, okay, so that one takes, changes it to just a regular shield. All right. Well, maybe I'll use that at some point. There's a fucking guy outside. Fire a beam in the designated direction that petrifies enemies. 
swing a sharp rotating disc in a desic Excuse me? Come. Go. Come. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Caught, did you notice that? This fucking item, like, kills the fucking frame rate. Like, hold on, I need to save here so I can show you. So, like... Oh, no! Oh, no! That's not good at all. That just fucking, like, made the frame rate die. I'm not certain if this is a good item to use in this moment, because, like... Oh, no! That's not good at all. Now, how much damage can this do? Oh, Jesus! Um... Okay! That item actually does some pretty good damage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait! We're on tower. Are we fighting the fucking dragon? Please tell me we're fighting the fucking dragon. Oh my god, this is another good boss from Blood's Dead. We are! Holy shit! Yes! Run! Oh, he's on both sides! Fuck! Okay, he does a lot of fucking damage. Oh fuck! Oh my god! No! Slide! Slide! Alright, alright. Gotta start going. Oh fuck! Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, it's back! Wait, what's back? Dream crashing? Or are you talking about the actual dragon? Just dragon! Oh, okay, okay, okay. Alright. Sorry, right. it was a while ago. Oh, okay. Was it like just for a moment? Oh god! Ah, fuck! Oh god, oh god, oh god. I need to like, what the fuck? It makes like a slippery floor or something? What the fuck? I, I gotta start making some, using some potions wisely. Oh god, that was loud. Shovel Knight saved me! Holy fuck, dude! Ah! Oh god, no! Piss off! Piss off! Elf, please. Oh God, what is this? Ah! I really don't know what the fuck is going on, and yet yeah, I'm still alive. Ah! Oh, I had to jump at that moment. Okay, so when they attack lower, you jump. Like, that attack is low. I know. Okay. I need to start using more potions. My last of my potions, so this ain't good. Okay. Time to jump. Double jump. Oh, God. Slide, 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 slide! Fuck! No! Take this. God damn it! Ah, fucking hell. Okay, now we have a better boss fight. Okay. Not as good as Burger King fry chicken fries, though. Still good, though.
Alright. Okay, so... Before I go back to that boss fight, I'm actually gonna do a wee bit more exploring. Because I know there was an elevator here, and I would actually like to see where it leads me. Alright, so we can go down. Oh! Oh, wait! Is this what leads me to... Ah! This leads me to the start of the tower! Okay, that's good. Thank you, game. I very much appreciate that. So if we go further up, this will take us to the top area. There we go. Nice. All right, now I just want to know where I am right now. Okay, so I'm right here. But there was one spot that I neglected to look at. Which was this way. Past the painting and the shield guy. There was another pathway this way. I'm not sure where this leads me. Fast travel! Thank you! This is why you explore before you th act accordingly. You'll save your goddamn life. God, I am loving this game so much. I need to play this during my own time. But I would also like to show off a lot of my uh, full-on live reactions. I just like this kind of game. I like the kind of games where you can explore. And it's one of the big reasons why I really like Blood... Uh, not Blood... Uh, Wolfenstein Youngblood. Because it has exploration like this. Like, it has much better world design than what the new Colossus had. Because you can actually, like, legitimately explore. And it doesn't, like, feel like you're going on a goose hunt for a fucking toy bus in a pile of rubble. Which is dumb in New Colossus. But now finding secrets feels a little bit more rewarding and... Exploring is, is a little bit more fun. I'm trying to squeeze through. Any ideas? Oh, that's right. There was some narrow holes. As a matter of fact, Zangetsu just sent a message arrow about that. In the gruesome hall of experiments, seek the demon darting through narrow holes. Darts. Sounds difficult to catch. Even the trickiest creatures have a weakness. You will find it. Now, is there anything else you need from me? Right. What are you looking to buy? So I can buy some stuff. I definitely do need some more potions, so I'm gonna go buy those. But I'm actually... I have a higher health priority, so I'm actually gonna buy some high potions. Is this right? Only, only like, maximum of five. That's all I really need. But I am also gonna start selling some stuff. Poison... A substance that will drain health over a period of time. I'm not sure if you could trace this on your weapon or anything, but it can sell for quite a lot. I don't want to sell any of, like, these materials because I don't know how to use them yet. And I would like to know before I even consider selling anything. But, but wool? You can sell sheep wool for 960 gold. Oh my god. I only have one of them, so again, I don't want to do anything. There's gemstones. I'm not sure if I can craft anything with these. Pretty sure I can, maybe. Oh my god, this music! A, plight, a light yet sturdy feather. Beautiful boots. That's right, I found an invisible sword. Wait. Hold on! Thank you. Come back. Hold on a minute. Wait, I was looking through cell items. I didn't even notice any of the other new weapons I have. Wait. Okay, so Deathbringer's 26. 
The Invisible Blade does 27 damage. All right, I want to take that out first. Okay, so it's more quick attack, but at the same time, I like the Deathbringer because it does some extra tiny damage. That's what I like about that one so much. I got a Flame Whip? Hello? Castlevania too much? Now, I'm not sure if this does the same thing as the Deathbringer does, but maybe it'll give me a reason to actually use a whip this time. Again, I don't like the attack speed. It feels very... Like, the recovery speed feels very slow. Excuse me? 45 damage. The fucking flame whip does more damage! Okay, I guess I'm favoriting you. Never really checked out the blunderbuss, though. The blunderbuss from World War II! <laughs> I don't... So fucking stupid. Let's actually do some crafting. Hey, buddy. Hi, Miriam. What are we transmuting this time? Alright, so... Oh, that's right! I can also make some potions, too. I completely forgot about that. Durr. Now, what other weapons can I start crafting? Uh, anything new? Surumaru. Blade with an elegant curve. The work of the swordsmith Kuninaga. Sounds like something Zangetsu would use, maybe. A short-barreled gun used in the Far East. Well, obviously, if it does more damage, I'd probably use that instead of the blunderbuss, so... I'll use it? I'll, go with this. I'll just make one of them. Also, I just realized the good condition stuff is primarily for my character's condition, not so much the weapon condition. So it looks like weapons can't break down, which is good. All right, is there any other better defense items I can craft? I can make a hound vest. I can use that from the pelt I found. All right, it does provide me with some more attack damage, defense, strength, and mind. The, Mantu the Mantua has a less attack and less strength. The Lamellar armor. Hello? Oh, that's just another notification on my phone. Nothing of great importance. Oh, so other rings. Oh, you can use the rubies to create rings that strengthen different abilities. Ah, ah. very interesting. So if I put on the flame ring, does that mean that the fire up does more damage? And the same thing with like the other stuff, like all these other uh, things. This would actually give me more reason to change between different classes and whatnot. So I think I'm gonna make one of each of these. I'll go with this. I think that'll really help me a lot. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. All right. Do you really want to buff flame again against the dragon? Well, I mean, here's the thing. the drag I don't think the dragon really has any real... Um, uh, if it's weaker to use fire against the dragon. But I'm talking about like just the whip in general, if I ever want to use that. Wait, I can craft a fucking shard? What? Creates a field of incinerating force. I can craft shards with other shards that I found. Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, I'll be damned. I had no idea that you could do such a thing. That's actually pretty intriguing. I can also craft the other uh, potions with a smaller one. So I think what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna make four regular ones and then I'll craft a, like maybe a few high ones. I'll just, I can only, look. All right, so there's a lot of really good weapons. I already have the flame bird, so I don't really need that. There's a lot of other really good weapons that I could craft. I already have the gun. He wields a gun. <laughs> Does that mean Miriam is the long, 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 long ancestor of fucking Joker? None of that matters. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do with cooking. Do I need the right ingredients to make these things, or what? I don't know what the fuck to do. 
I can also try enhancing some shards. All right, can I? And what's this? Familiar Dentalion, and the the Dulla Hammerhead. Okay, can I can I enhance Shovel Knight? I can with a shovel, but I don't want to use a shovel. I want to use the shovel so I can play a Shovel Knight when I get the armor. And I can I can try and change some of these other things. I'll upgrade the True Arrow. I'll go with this. I can also use the Dreadful Rag in order to upgrade again. Am I at the highest rank? I do like the things that you can do. Extend a shaft of rotating blades in the designated direction. This one's 30 per second. I'll try and start upgrading some of these other ones because I think they might be pretty useful when you, at some point. I don't know about the shield though, but maybe that might be useful at some point. I'll upgrade this one twice. The circular rifters. Swing a sharp rotating. Di oh, that's the one that was causing the frame rate to die out. All right. All right. I will upgrade this twice. And I lost all my my razors, so there's that. Resist poison. I'll go with this. Could upgrade all of the other familiars. I can't upgrade the fucking fairy. Oh, I don't have fairy dust to upgrade it. All right. Welcome company. Up. Uh, uh. For some reason, the down. D button on my d-pad wasn't working there for a moment weird all right maybe when i get more shovels i'll upgrade the shovel armor conjure a column of flame i can use a ruby to upgrade that i'll use i'll use one trust me you never know what these things could do to craft work grab an on grab onto certain objects to manipulate them oh you can also use this to to attack capacity cannon scrap I only have one of those, though. Beast Guardian, summon a wolfman to guard you from frontal attacks. Thanks. Ew. Once I only have... I can use one Sinister Pelt. Ah, I think I'll wait on those. Why is the deep... The bottom D-pad not working? I mean, now it is, but it's like... It keeps on, like, sticking every now and then. Like, not, like, actually, like, physically sticking, but... It doesn't work a lot of the time. If you ever encounter a demon named Bale... Run. I haven't, but I'm curious why I should. Because he's the most powerful of the 72 demons. A quick escape may be the only thing that saves you. Okay. Alright, All right. D-pad seems to be working fine now. Right. Time to save. Ah. Uh, mm, excuse me. Yeah, I think the fire whip is actually pretty nice. Oh, hey, Sengatsu! And he just runs. Fucking asshole! still haven't told me. Sorry, Miriam. It's alright. I'm used to it. The gifted ones are always the hardest to manage. So, what can I do for you? Yeah, I was probably gonna do a little bit more stuff. I have something new to offer you. New to offer What are you me? looking to buy? I don't see anything new. Uh, I don't see anything. Wait, other? But oh, okay, I see. Whenever I craft something, I can then buy it afterwards. Nice. What are you looking to sell? I gotta sell some of these things. Let's call forth an insect that attacks diagonally forward. I don't really need this. We have a deal. Welcome company. I'll sell two of these. Have a deal. I'll sell one of the guardians. Alchemic Bounty. Occasionally, the number of items attained from crafting increases. Wait, oh, just from crafting? Holy shit. Call him Flame. Call forth a bat. 
Cerulean Smash. Bone Toss. I'm mostly just selling a lot of the copies. What are you looking to sell? Alright, what can I sell? Why do you sell the why do you let me sell the rings for a lower price than when you buy it? If that makes no goddamn sense whatsoever. So many masks you can buy. I like the sunglasses though, so I'm not really gonna bother with that. Wait, the fucking riding habit. What does this thing do? A riding garment designed with electricity in mind. Thank you. I'll be Alright. I think it's time that we progress. Let's go try and fight that dragon again. Yeah, this thing does much more damage than what the the axe does, so I will see how this works against the other guy. Alright, so let's go back to the tower. The Tower of the Twin Dragons. So that's what they're called, the Twin Dragons. Alright, now before we do anything, I'm actually going to change my shortcuts a little bit. Alright, so I'm gonna keep the flame whip on this one. We keep the beasted beret. Wait, does do any of these do more things? Oh, the wolf hood does more defense and strength. So does the feather crown, huh? Oh no. Oh no. The fucking cat is making a mess. The other one, not the one that would have happened yesterday. Oh, please don't don't tell me you did it on the regular floor. Ah, son of a bitch. I might have to take a break for a little bit. Um, just gonna change a few things and then I'll take care of that. Um, oh jeez. Oh. But does different. That does lower attack though. I'll keep the sunglasses on. But all right. So the hyperventilator is another thing. More defense. Tattered scarf. I'll keep on. Shovel armor, craft work, circular ripper, and the familiar carabos. Actually, I would I wanted to use the flame ring on one of these. Oh, it strengthens fire abilities, but it also increases defense. Well, I guess I'll have to get rid of the hyperventilator because it made me look so badass, though. All right, I'll also change this one to give me the, um, the Deathbringer. No, wait, did I keep the Beast Beret? No, I didn't. This one I will. But I'm also going to keep the Kung Fu Vest. I'll keep the sunglasses. And the Hyperventilator. Basically anything that I had before I'll keep here. But for this one, I'm going to keep True Arrow on. Increases firearm damage. Enemies. Oh. Sorry, just gotta take this for a moment. I gotta turn off the sound on this thing. Because I don't want it to interrupt anything. You might feel the vibration, but it's not really much. Alright, so... Increases your intelligence. Faster casting. I might keep that there, but for this one... I'm going to change the... Car not the Carabos, this one to pickpocket. Because I want to see what that does. All right, so I'm going to call this one. Wow. This was, I'm just going to randomly call this one Fireball. Okay, whatever. And I'll just call this one Casual. Ca no, actually, you know what? Casual Plebeian. Oh, right there. All right. 
All right. Uh, now how do I use how do I use this one? Oh, I hold L2. All right. So, I'm going to pause right now. I got to take care of what what happened with the cat. So, just bear me a moment. All right, sorry about that. Uh, false alarm, apparently, because I couldn't find anything. But she was taking a rest in her little bed upstairs. Gave her some loving. Anyway, back to business at hand. Okay. So this one apparently does less damage on. Um, okay, so that one does 37 damage on. Right, that one does 47 damage on, holy shit. All right, well, let's go down. I don't remember. That's wrong. So 38 damage each. 38. I really can't really attack it. Get stuck in there. Oh, pfft. the bag got stuck on the ceiling. I can't even grab it. That's dumb. All right, so let's try using the regular Deathbringer. 
Okay, so that one does 33 plus 7. So that's like why one more point. Th the bag doesn't even land on the floor. What the shit? Alright, so how much damage does this do on this guy? 16 and 1. Okay, so this one does more damage. It definitely does more damage. But it's just slower attack. Alright, actually got the thing there. Silver, damn. Alright, well, now that I got everything at hand, let's actually go and save our game. Alright, let me actually have a little bit more of this watermelon. Don't want it to get soggy. Not really going to waste any time with you. So let's go and try this again, shall we? Wait, act, hold on. Seems I can't get up there. Alright. I thought maybe there'd be something there, but I was wrong. The Twin Dragons! a lot more damage than the the arrows, I think. Alright. I need to keep an eye out for that attack, because the first time I was... Oh god! No! No! I am not going to die to a dragon. No! Alright. Alright. I need to really start thinking about those, because the moment he lifts their heads up, it's like, oh shit, he's going to attack either higher or lower. Too quick to react! What did I just do? I accidentally jumped right in between. I'm gonna go wasting Shovel Knight just yet. Oh no, you're not running away from me, motherfucker. Oh god. Getting good at dodging the fire. Yeah, it's not, that one's not very hard to really get at the back of my head. Because literally, it's just him hitting the floor and going back and forth. It's a very easy attack. So using sliding in my advantage. Exo slide. Okay, there we go. I just realized he was doing that thing. Oh fuck! Oh god, they did it again! Okay, need to be a little bit closer. Oh god, fuck.
hard to sometimes predict when they're going to do that attack. Snake Charmer. <laughs> I bet David Hader would be so proud. Inferno Breath. Expel frames in designated direct. I can shoot out flames. Hell yeah. I got a gold chest. Silver Bromide. Ooh, nice. I did it. I won. Yay. All right, let's go explore. See if there's anything else that I might be missing. All right, that seems like to be. Oh, wait, there's a wall blocking it. Is there anything here? Nope, just seems to be blocking the area. All right. Well, in that regard, let's just keep going this way. All right, nothing down this way. Except maybe something. Oh, wait. There's the entrance. Wait, have I been here before? Oh, this was the bottom of the elevator. God, I'm so dumb. And this, the thing just spirals around. There is nothing else to see here aside from like the same stuff. And the gold chest right there. Shit. Yeah, there's the elevator. Oh, thank you. I was wondering where the hell that thing was. So now what do I do? Oh, fuck. Hi, Wolfman. Dead. Alright, so what do I do now? Alright, I took care of that boss. I'm not sure where to go now. Fuck! I keep forgot. I've completely forgot about the Wolfman. No! I must run! I am not here to fight the Wolfman. He is a fluffy doggo man, and I don't want to hurt the doggo man. Doggo man is cool. Us. Oh, derp. I was saying, oh, hey, look, it's your fairy friends, and they're gonna die. Oh. There's a train station here. Dead. I killed the cow. I got beast, Brett. Beast beef. I got beef with this beast. Hi, pussy girl. How you doing? Motherfuckers. Another one of those fucking things. No, I don't want to kill the doggo. No, I don't want to abuse file for dog abuse. No. All right, I'm just going to run. I'm just going to run. These things used to hop around in the air and try and stomp on you, but now they don't do that again, I suppose. Oh, that's right. Now I can take the train. Oh, wait, that's right. I need the picture of myself in order to take the pass from the guy at the store. Uh, Alucard wannabe, basically. I also need to heal again. Too low on health if I really want to do anything. No, I don't want to hurt the doggo. Don't want to hurt the dog. Bye. I don't want to kill the puppy. Run. No, I don't want to die from the dog. He's too cute. All right. No, I don't want to do that. Fuck off. And 
Now, I don't know if there's any other area in particular that I should be going. Now, I am currently... All right, that's a save spot. I should probably save, admittedly. Just run. Uh, mm, excuse me. Oh. <laughs> I look so goofy with that fucking wolf head. I only just realized that now. Yeah, this fucking shard, I'm like beast. Oh. Oh! Wait. What did I just do there? Did I just do like a fucking forward dash? Monkey! And he had a chest. A moon belt. What the hell is a moon belt? Moon belt. A belt with a moon design that improves your back, your back step ability. Oh. Well, let's give that a try. Eh, not by much, but it does make me go farther, I think. Oh yeah, that makes me go further back. Okay, that's actually pretty helpful. I should probably go down to the underground area. That would actually make the most sense because there was an area that I could double jump in that I, w that I couldn't before because I didn't have the ability. Oh yeah, fucking caribou. Yeah, just need to go. Actually, no, I could probably just fast travel there. Rather than, like, you know, waste time, because, I mean, I've already explored this area, pretty much. Let's go back this way. Ah. Jesus Christ, that thing really does the damage well. That weapon of power does the damage well on the enemy, yes. Sound like fucking Starfire from Teen Titans. Not Teen Titans, go. No. Yeah. Curious to know when the DLC is going to come out, because there's like... 13 different kinds for free, and none of which has been announced as of yet. our boy Shovel Knight. Maybe if we're lucky we'll find some armor. Nah, you're not allowed to have that. 
Hello. I really wish I had a camera for the PlayStation so I could show you my cat here. This is Pussy Girl. She's a bit of an old fart, but she's still very lovable. She likes to crawl over every once in a while. Oh, yeah, careful there. <laughs> you don't want to drop those things there. I want to piss off mom. All right, why don't you go lay down there? She's a black and white cat. I don't know the name of the breeds. It's not really my uh, 4K and like m m of knowledge. All right, I've already been that way. But I would like to see if I can find any other pathways that'll help me out. Oh yeah, that's right. I know I missed a blue chest, but that's not my priority. All right, so I don't have the key for that just yet. Or at least I, well, there's no key. You gotta go on the other side, and I just don't know how to get there yet. All right, let's go kill this next Shovel Knight. Easy. <laughs> I'm trying to get a better understanding of the, um, that one shard. I wasn't sure if it... Does it mean that I get more items from crafting, or does it mean I get more items from killing enemies? What are you dropping? Oh, I got another shovel. Awesome. I just want to play a Shovel Knight, man. And I'm serious, if I, if I can get that armor, I will legit play a Shovel Knight for the rest of this fucking game if I want to. Right, let's just save since we've gotten this far. We're gonna probably go for like 10 more minutes and then I'll end the stream there, because at that point I'll have like an hour before I have to go. And I'd like to at least prepare myself and maybe just relax a little bit. Can you die, will you please? Well, I got it! Yes! I got the shovel armor! Yes! I'm Shovel Knight! Ah! <laughs> I did it! Fuck yes! I get to be Shovel Knight! Okay, 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 okay. Calm down. I need to calm down. Oh my god. That looks so fucking ridiculous. <laughs> okay, okay. I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I'm just gonna call this one Shovel Knight. Alright, I'm just gonna change that one to the Shovel. Keep the shovel armor on. All right, now what other equipment should I have? I want to have equipment that's at least stronger. I'll keep the unicorn ring on. The moon belt I will also keep on. I'm not sure if I can backdash while I'm playing a shovel knight. I can summon. I'll sh summon another shovel knight while I'm playing a shovel knight. Oh, oh, inferno breath. That should be that should be helpful. Can I even do my my abilities there? Oh my god, can I backdash? I can't backdash, I can only do the classic Shovel Knight moves. Ooh, I can do up thrusts, that's cool. I could do downward thrusts and everything. I can't double jump either, so that might actually be a problem. <laughs> shovel Knight versus Shovel Knight! Oh, there could only be one! Fuck off. <laughs> I am so fucking giddy right now. All right, so I need to shift back just for a quick moment. Because I need to get up here. Okay, I can't seem to get up there. Never mind. Alright, back to Shovel Knight. 
<laughs> oh my god, this is so fucking cool. Cot, I did it. I did it, Cot. I found it. Oh shit, fuck. Kill him! I killed him. Oh my god, this is fucking... Oh, hello. Oh god! Wait, how do I get out? How do I get out? How do I get out? I can't get... What? So I just need to wait until I get higher? Okay, there we go. Whew, that, was, that was close there for a moment. I did it! Ah, I got triple die! Ah! <laughs> Alright. Alright, hold on. Okay, come on. I did it. I am so proud of myself. Someone save that as a highlight, me getting friggin' Shovel Knight. God damn it. Oh my god. <laughs> the way he slides around is just fucking amazing. <laughs> I I couldn't preoccupy it. Ah, it's okay. When the stream is done, maybe someone can probably make a clip. I can't even duck down. This is actually gonna be a bit of a problem. I can't even do diagonal attacks. Okay, I think I need to take a break from this. Fuck. Yeah, I need I need to be able to attack certain enemies. And just generally survive. But in any case, I'm happy I got him. I did it. Oh my god. I just need to save. I just need to save real quick. Oh my god. Let's go for Shovel Knight again. <laughs> he takes him down in two. How much more damage can this do? It's like just 32 damage. Okay. I can also do it on candles. Wait. I can do it on candles? Wait. Wait. Hold the fucking phone, I just... Oh no. Oh no, I just realized something. If I can do that on candles... Does that mean... Okay, hold on, I need to first get up here. Alright, back to Miriam. Ruby and an emerald, nice! I'm probably just gonna, like, sell those because it's not really worth owning them in the first place. Back up we go. You will not destroy me, brethren! I was about to end the stream anyway, but I think this is a good way to end it off because I finally got fucking Shovel Knight and I'm happy that it happened. But unfortunately, I'm actually at the point where I need to end the stream because I have like an hour left before I go to work, but I am glad that I did this and I think this is just a, a good opportunity to end it. So yeah, I know stream crash, but anyway, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, if you were charged with joining this stream and you liked it, please be sure to give us a follow. And if you want to check out any of our other shenanigans and whenever we're about to keep up to date, like whenever we want to keep up to date with our streams, you can check out the Joy Charge Gamers Twit Twitter account. You can also check out my Twitter account if you want to see whenever I'm streaming or generally just any other shenanigans at, at all. You can also check out Kotlol's Twitter account at Kotlolish. You can check out Brownie and the Kivatus as well. Akot, if you could put these down, please, if you would. Because I can't do it. I mean, I, I can do it. I just can't really uh, do the whole thing. I mean, my voice is probably still playing, isn't it? Okay, thank you, Cot. I was about to play, put it in, but anyway, you can check out all that stuff. And, of course, if you want to check out any streams that you missed, you can also check out the archive channel right there. And, of course, with, of course, we also have our main YouTube channel if you want to keep up to date with potentially any highlights. That Shovel Knight one. 
We'll probably make it up on there. I'll probably get it up or maybe someone else will. I'm not entirely sure. But that was a good moment and I really want to do that. So um, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Brian from Joy Charge Gamers. We've been playing Bloodstained Ritual of the Night and we finally got fucking Shovel Knight. Glory! Steal that shovel! I was about to say glory to shovel or something like that. But, but anyway, this has been Brian from Joy Charge Gamers. We've been playing Bloodstained Ritual of the Night and I will see you all next time. Farewell! Goodbye, everyone! I shall see you all next time. Goodbye. See ya! Bye.